Aspidocalone, also known as the island turtle, is a legendary creature that is often depicted as a massive sea turtle or a giant sea serpent. It is said to be the size of a small island, with a shell that is large enough to support an ecosystem of plants and animals. Aspidocalone's unique features include its massive size and the ability to camouflage itself as an island, making it difficult to spot by sailors. It is said to have the ability to summon a strong current to drag ships and sailors under the water, and some tales claim that it can even breathe fire. Aspidocalone is typically found in the deep sea, far from land. Its natural habitat is the open ocean, and it is born like any other sea turtle, laying eggs on beaches. Its method of reproduction is unknown. In mythology, Aspidocalone is often portrayed as a deceptive creature, luring sailors onto its back with the promise of a safe harbor or island, only to drag them under the water and drown them. Other tales describe it as a benevolent creature that provides a safe haven for fish and sea creatures. It is unclear whether Aspidocalone sleeps or not, as it is a mythical creature. It is believed to have originated from medieval European folklore. To ward off Aspidocalone's abilities, sailors would often use charms or spells to protect their ships. One common method was to carve a protective symbol, such as a cross, onto the ship's mast or hull. Wearing amulets or charms that were believed to offer protection from sea monsters was also common. To survive an encounter with Aspidocalone, sailors were advised to avoid sailing too close to it, as it may mistake the ship for prey. Some tales suggest that sailors could also appease the creature with offerings or sacrifices. Luring and trapping Aspidocalone would be a difficult task, as it is a massive creature that is constantly on the move. In tales, sailors would often use a decoy, such as a wooden ship, to attract Aspidocalone's attention and then flee. As Aspidocalone is a mythical creature, there is no surefire way to defeat it. In some tales, it is defeated by a hero who outwits the creature or discovers its weaknesses. In others, it is left alone as a powerful force of nature that cannot be tamed. 